Okay, so in this video, we need to solve another quadratic equation, 3x squared minus 4x minus 7. Once again, we need to use the AC method. Our A number is 3, our C number is negative 7. 3 times negative 7 gives us negative 21. Next, we're looking for factors of 21 that add up to negative 4. And the ones that work, negative 7, and positive 3 because negative 7 times positive 3 makes 21 but negative 7 plus positive 3 makes negative 4 so that we know that these two numbers are the combination we're after now this is not the final factorization this is the setup x minus 7 x plus 3 you can see if we were to foil this out we would not have the original number, the original trinomial. So we know that this is not the finished factorization. We have to count for 3. So we take 3 and divide it into each term. If it divides, great. This one does, x plus 1. And that factorization is finished. But over here, 7 doesn't divide evenly by 3. So we're going to kick this 3 out in front. 3x minus 7. This is the correct factorization. Now it's up to us to simply solve each term to find the value of x. I think the second one is pretty easy. Negative 1 plus 1 equals 0. So there's one answer. Negative 1. The other answer, we need to add 7 to both sides. We're left with 3x equals 7 and then we divide by 3 on each side. x equals 7 thirds. Two answers, x equals 7 thirds and x equals negative 1.